I bought this storage unit for $160. So let's go ahead and get started. Before we get into the video, did you know that only a small portion of y'all are subscribed? So if you could subscribe right now, that'd be a huge help. All right, let's get to the video. It's not gonna be a lot, because the main things are these boxes here, but look in the corner there. I'm not sure exactly what that is, but uh, it's about the right height for a shotgun, so we'll see about that. And I'm pretty sure there's gonna be nothing else past this. Yeah, so there's the wall right there. So essentially all we have is gonna be these boxes right here. And I will use this table as a workbench. This is something. Oh, it's one of those shovels. Survival shovel. Yep. Got a really, oh, he's heavy. Got a really dirty frog. And then, uh, Got a chest here, so. This looks good. Oh, it's empty. Oh, no, it's not. I got 50 cents. Uh, paperwork, paperwork. That's kind of cool looking. I don't know what this is. It's kind of cool looking. I'm just going to assume it's some sort of smoking thing. If I can get the stickers off of the chest, I might be able to sell the chest. Got a blue grandeur jacket. Leather jacket, which is kind of cool. Got a... Looks like more Halloween decorations. Which is good because Halloween is right around the corner. So, oh, I've seen this guy before. I think he's... I've seen one where he's like motorized or something. This is a little zombie baby. And then uh, a mossy oak vertigo bow and arrow. And then what else we got? Um, giant skeleton, which I'm not going to remove just for simplicity. There's a. Uh, I can get it out. I think it's caught in his leg. There we go. Got a slingshot. And then the giant skeleton is about the only thing left in there. Oh, yeah. I also have this. <laughs> um, I found that. So that's a, a big old Bowie knife. Wild Turkey Handmade Collection. An interesting box. Oh, I don't know if I brought my... Yeah, it says trash on it. I didn't bring my knife. But it's a good thing I have a knife. <laughs> I have mine if you need it. No, this is funny. Ooh. Wow. Thought I smelled something. Um, honestly, some of these That's can... That's a pretty cool bottle collection. Yeah. I don't know why it's labeled trash. Like, I can put some of this in my booth. For a little bit. Is that going to be sturdy enough to put more stuff on? Yeah, probably, right? This one will be quick. Just a bunch of cords. What are you? Some sort of radio. Emergency radio flashlight. Maybe. Yeah. But that's it for that. I wasn't really good at labeling boxes because this says food and it's not. Comically large and knife. No, oh, this is good. It's empty though. That at least has a little bit of potential. This one sounds in there. Yeah, so that's in there. Assassin's Creed Valhalla, not in there. Just Dance is in there. Okay, so that's it for that one. Let's get this one. Another Smirnoff bottle. And another, geez, man. I don't think there's much in here except for more bottles. And a, uh... Tire iron? Yeah, tire iron. So, oh, that's nice, actually. I need that. Go ahead and call this one done. So let's go ahead and see what's in here, shall we? 
Absolutely. It's heavy. It's either, I mean, it has a possibility. I've bought it thinking that it could be a shotgun case, but I don't think so. Just because of the sounds that are coming from it. What are you? Some sort of stand. Oh, it's a stripper pole. <laughs> it's uh, much less exciting than the shotgun case. person was quite the character. Yeah, he was. <clears throat> you find a lot of interesting things in there. What is this? Portable shower? Maybe? No, it's a water filtration system. Oh, okay. Okay. This looks like just kitchen stuff. Yeah. So that's all kitchen stuff. Decent. Yeah, it looks like it's in good shape. Yeah. I'll probably sell all the furniture, the mattress and stuff too for 50 bucks, yeah. Is that a frog? Yeah, it's a giant frog. Just a big old frog. Oh, there's a gas mask, I think. That's what that is. It's a taxidermy oh, rat. Gross. Gas mask. Um, and this is the dude, uh, what's his name? Yeah, from Nightmare Before Christmas. Okay, let's continue. These are all so light. No, it's just more Halloween stuff. Hobbies, very fragile. Okay, no. There's something uh, that I'm not going to show you in there. <laughs> it was, yeah. You can use your imagination on what that would be. No, thank you. Yeah. Some more Halloween stuff. So, I'm going to lock all this up together. A bunch of Halloween masks. Let's see, more Halloween stuff, but drugs and stuff this time. Well, I think you're losing money on this one. Maybe. There's still a few boxes left. <laughs> I'm gonna be, uh, I don't know if I should open it. <laughs> I'm not even gonna open this one. I mean, it was marked out. It was. I'm gonna it's... peek into it, just briefly. Okay, I'll stand over here. <laughs> It may have been that other box. I think it was just blankets. Yeah, it's just blankets in a sleeping bag. So it's not what it said it was. Which means I think that was in the other box. But still, that's pretty disgusting. This says pillows. It's light enough, it's definitely pillows. I'm not gonna worry about that. Oh, I didn't even open this one. More Halloween stuff. I actually don't think I'm losing money on this one, surprisingly enough. It's more just Halloween stuff, really. That Bowie knife, I don't think I can sell on eBay, though, because it's too large. Right. Okay. Just quickly check this. Some jeans. Some other clothes. Yeah, there's a wetsuit in here, which... Could be good. Looks like it's in good condition. Yeah. A Kona, A-K-O-N-A. -A. Oh, it's not bad. Got a, it's I'm probably not gonna sell it, so I'm just gonna open it up. There we go. Um, jacket, that's a hammock, I think. Or a tent top. Yeah, it's a tent. 
There's a phone, and another phone, and then that's it. There's a fan up there, but I'm not worried about that. Oh, that is disgusting. Yeah, that was uh, an interesting episode. <laughs> not very good, but uh, if you guys enjoyed, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me out, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Peace.